Hello guys, this is Telegram. Welcome to Learning Ladder of C language. In this tutorial, we are going to discuss about if conditional statement. If conditional statement is used for the conditional execution of the block of statements or a single statement in C language. Syntax for declaration of if conditional statement in C language is if and followed by curly braces and inside these curly braces we have to specify the condition and then the flower brace flower braces inside this flower braces we are going to write the statements this conditional state this condition is suppose if it's true then this block of statements will be executed if suppose this conditional statement is false then this block of statement is not going to execute similarly followed by the if conditional statement there is an else statement this else statement is used for the anti to the if say if statement if suppose if statement is false then else uh, methods will be executed if suppose if statement is true then automatically else methods will not be executed now let's see a small example program here first i am using the if conditional statement in this condition i am specifying it is isn't true in c language there there it allows a boolean uh, data type that is true or false if suppose it is true then automatically this um, methods in this block will be executed if suppose we are declaring it is a false then automatically this block of methods will not be executed let's see in an output here i am using true in the if conditional statement so it should execute this printf statement so it executed the printf statement we are getting an output as if condition is true if suppose i am using false in this conditional condition declaration then automatically this method in this block will won't be executed let's see now here we are not getting any output in the command flow now i am using the else statement followed by if statement if can so if suppose if condition statement is false then automatically else statement should be executed and the method within the after this else should be executed so this print of statement should execute and we are going to get now put in the output screen let's see an output here we are getting if condition is false so now we are getting an idea about an if and else we can use if statement without using the else but without having an if statement the else won't be executed let's see an example here i am declaring else without an if conditional statement then let's see an output here the compiler throws that the else is without a previous if statement so automatically the if else statement won't be executed without having an if if suppose we are using an if conditional statement without any flower braces then what will we will get an as an output let's see here i am using an if statement without having a flower braces and i am going to compile this program we are getting an output without having any error this is because if suppose we are not declaring in any block after followed by the if statement then automatically if will execute and first statement belong the, um, after this if statement uh, if suppose we are writing any other another statement after this first statement it won't going to execute it it's going to uh, terminate by the first statement itself now let's see an example for this here i am using two printf statements followed by if condition but i am not declare any flower braces let's see an output we are getting it both output as if condition is true and followed by if second method this is why because this if statement will work only for the first uh, statement and the uh, the second statement it will be executed as a flow of a program from top to bottom so now i am using false uh, false in the condition in the if statement so let's see in output we are getting if second method this is because if will have an effect from for the first statement with if we are using without and flower braces it won't affect the second statement so automatically it's the second statement treated as a no, normal statement so it will execute as a flow of program 
from top to bottom. If suppose I am using an else statement without having a flower basis with the two statements in if, then automatically the compiler will throw an error that else statement is without an if because the if statement is going to end with a first statement so it won't go execute the while it's coming to the second statement automatically it treats that if it's, uh, it's ended so uh, this uh, after executing this second uh, printf statement the else is identified this else has no previous if statement the compiler will treat like that so the else uh, compiler throws an error that else is without an if statement Similar to the if condition statement, the else also allow a single okay, execution of a statement without having a flower basis. Now let's see an output. We are getting if condition is false. This, this is why because else, uh, else has a property to execute a single statement followed by this condition without having a flower basis. If suppose we are declaring any second method, then automatically compiler treat it is a normal program execution. So it's going to execute the same printf statement and take a printf statement i'm going to press here so let's execute it now we are getting if condition is false and similar to if condition is true this is why because else will be terminated with this first statement itself and the while getting to into the, the second printf statement automatically the compiler treat it is a new statement without the uh, having this effect on if and else in the next tutorial let me have a discuss about an uh, nested if statements thank you that's all on this tutorial don't forget to subscribe to get an alert for the next tutorial video thank you